Indian tennis has always flown on talent. Now, here's the story of a player with extraordinary talent who, according to critics, though, has not lived up to his promise. Sports Zone's Aditya Banerjee catches up with Indian Davis Cup Karan Rastogi, who's fit and raring to have a go after two injury plagued seasons. Hi, I'm Karan Rastogi. I'm making a comeback in 2010. Watch out. Till around three years back, he was the next big thing in Indian tennis. But a nagging back injury put a question mark over a promising career. A year and a half on the sidelines has made him wiser. And luckily, motivation hasn't been a problem. I was about very close to you know giving up the sport and you know trying to do other things, which you know would have been the easier way out. I could have just said, no, I don't feel like playing anymore, and you know uh, gone and done other things. But I, I really wanted to do this. Wanted to come back and you know just prove to myself that uh, I could do it again and get back to the level that I was. Mumbai lad Karan Rastogi was one of the most talented players in the world junior circuit in the earlier part of the decade. A semi-final appearance in the Australian Open Junior Championship in 2004 set expectations soaring sky high. A call-up to the Davis Cup followed but the teenager, earmarked for excellence, got lost somewhere in transition. It is tough. Indians generally do develop and mature a lot later than the Europeans or the Americans. So for an Indian, I think peaking is between 24 and 27 years old. And I'm just 23 right now. So, you know, I still have a few more years to go, few, a lot more to give um, for myself. So I'm really looking forward to the challenge ahead. Critics have called in question his big match temperament. And he is hungrier than ever before to prove them wrong. I enjoy spending time on court. I mean, I've probably worked as hard as I could uh, and I'm still not done so you know I've had a bad luck with injuries um, so you know hopefully over the next couple of years I'm start playing again so for me that's the biggest positive I mean as long as I'm healthy and enjoying the sport doesn't really matter to me what other people say. At a time when his predecessors and contemporaries like Mahesh Bhupati, Somdev Dev Barman and Sanam Singh moved off to the US on a tennis scholarship, Karan had other plans. He decided to turn professional to go through the grinds of life on the tour. Every tennis player gets to a point in their career where they've got to make a decision whether, you know, either they go to college and study and, you know, try and uh, keep up with tennis there or, you know, turn pro. And for me, turning pro was the obvious choice because uh, luckily I had something to fall back on. I mean, my dad has a business and everything. It's too big a risk to take for a sports person, especially in India because they don't have the support from the federation or the government that you know you would have in other countries. There is plenty on his platter and the urge to put on the national team t-shirt once again keeps him going. Um, I'm starting off with uh, Egypt next week. There's a bunch of tournaments there. I'm going to be there for about a month. Uh, representing your country I think is the biggest honor for any sportsman. So um, doing well in the Commonwealth Games, getting selected for the team um, this year for I think the Commonwealth and the Asian Games. I played the Asian Games uh, last time around in Doha. So. Um, it's been, it was a fantastic experience for me, so I would love to uh, live it again. Karan Rastogi knows that this could be his final shot at glory. The next two seasons would be make or break for him. And here's wishing Karan all the luck on his much awaited comeback. From tennis courts to Bollywood sets, his plans have always been high profile and ambitious. Well, he's even lived up to them. Alright, so what is the buzz about? Oh, nothing, just that Leander Pace is planning to be a Bollywood star now. I know you want to know more, so just take another little break and come back soon.